Today I'm visiting Charlestown Landing in Charleston, South Carolina. My name is Gary Fabian and I'm a realtor with Colwell Banker Realty. Charlestown Landing is listed on the National Register of Historic Places that sits on a marshy site off the Ashley River. This is the exact spot where about 160 English settlers landed in 1670 to establish the first colony in South Carolina. So what is there to do at Charlestown Landing besides taking in all of the historic nature and beauty of this site? Well, I'm so excited to tell you all about this wonderful place that I've visited numerous times since my childhood. Here at Charlestown Landing, you can take a tour of the adventure. It's the only 17th century replica trading vessel in the Charleston area. Here you can get a glimpse of what it was like sailing the open seas in the 1600s. The animal forest is one of my favorite things to do at Charlestown Landing. Here you can find animal species that were native to the area at the time of settlement in a 22-acre natural habitat. You'll also find interpretive trails with miles of walking paths. Here you'll notice lovely azaleas in the springtime, beautiful magnolias and live oak trees, some of which are over a hundred years old. There's also an exhibit hall inside the visitor center with interactive experiences to get a feel with what early living in the colony was like. Charlestown Landing also has an original settlement area from 1670 to 1680 that features reconstructed fortifications and crop gardens. You can also visit the Native American Ceremonial Center to learn how the Native Americans, Africans, Barbadians, and English worked together to make this such a successful colony in 1670. And don't forget to stop by the lovely Legree Waring House, which has become one of Charleston's favorite spots for a wedding venue. And of course, you have the opportunity to bird watch, rent bicycles, and enjoy the gift shop during your visit. Besides taking in all the beauty, history, and interactive experiences at the historic Charlestown Landing, you also have lots of open space to enjoy picnics and leisure activities with your family and friends. And of course, your dogs are welcome here as well. Oftentimes, people will ask me, what is so special about Charleston? And why are there so many people wanting to live here? Well, the answer is very simple. With all of the wonderful surrounding neighborhoods filled with Southern charm, there are so many places like Charlestown Landing to visit and to soak up the rich history Charleston has to offer. If you're thinking about moving to Charleston or the surrounding area, or for any real estate needs you may have, I would love the opportunity to talk with you. Just call, text, or email me. It would be my pleasure to speak with you. Hey, if you like this video, it would mean the world to me if you would click on that like button. Also, for all my other videos, please click subscribe so you don't miss out on all the Charleston area has to offer.